Everyone has been asking me to try out this video, so I just bought a toaster and I have some steak, and we're gonna see, can you cook steaks in a toaster? First up, season with some salt bay apple. Then some freshly cracked black pepper. A little drizzle of oil. And flip, and flip. And some more salt bay action. And of course, some more black pepper. Then, since last time you guys roasted me for not seasoning my steak enough, I'm also gonna go in there with some Jamaican jerk seasoning, so they're a little bit full of spice. Flip again. Bam. And Jamaican jerk seasoning on the other side. All right, so I went to the store and bought a classic toaster, and now we are going to take our steaks, bam, and just put it into the toaster. This feels like it should be like a food crime. And the other steak into the toaster as well. I'm now turning it on to the hottest setting, lowering it down. And now listen, it is starting to cook. I can't wait to see if this works. All right, I don't know about you, but this is definitely the strangest sight I have ever seen in a toaster. All right, it has now been about three, four minutes, and I don't know if you can see on camera, there is some like smoke wafting off. It is starting to smell like a delicious steak. All right, let's take a peep in here. It looks like, oh, it just popped up a little bit. It looks like our steaks are getting seared. Oh, wow. All right, it has now been five minutes. Let's eject our toast. So that's not toast, it is steak. Let's give it a look. All right, it is not fully cooked, but we definitely have some nice sear on there. All right, so our steak is definitely cooking. It is obviously not done, but I mean, the toaster is doing its job. Okay, update. It is really starting to smell like a barbecue in here. It smells like we're cooking Jamaican jerk steaks, which is exactly what we're doing, but instead of a grill, it's a toaster. All right, I think our steaks are done. Let's take them out and give them a try. All right, let's try to get out our steak. Have to say, for a steak cooked in a toaster, these don't look that bad. Just slice our steak and see how it is cooked. All right. Looks like it's a little bit uh, well done. I mean, look at that beautiful meat juice. You guys can't say that this steak does not have flavors. My other steaks were bland. This one might be well done, but at least it has the beautiful Jamaican jerk seasoning. That is a flavorful steak. It is packed with flavor. There you go. We have learned that you can cook a steak in yet another piece of equipment. Comment down below if there's any I missed. So far, we've done it in an iron, a hair straightener, and a blowtorch, and now we've added a toaster to the list. If there's anything I'm forgetting, comment down below and I will give it a try. I think what I've learned is I just need to use a thicker steak next time so that the inside doesn't overcook and get well done. These are very thin steaks, so it kind of makes sense why they overcooked. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to comment down below. Let me know what else I should cook a steak in. And hit that follow button if you haven't already. And hit the like button if you haven't already if you enjoyed watching the video. All right, if you need me, I'm going to enjoy my Jamaican jerk steak.